I'm kind of a sucker for an urban river. A tidal urban river is like my favorite thing to deal with. The idea that we have this like living beast, this liquid beast that rises and falls twice a day. I love the fact that there's a bigger rhythm out there that we can observe. trying to make a work that brings people down to meet the river, see the changes, so they might get to know it and then they'll get to love it and then they'll want to preserve it. A lot of people doesn't stop and take time out to actually breathe and enjoy life. So out here you actually get that sense of feeling. <laughs> Not that many places have tidal rivers. Philadelphia is a good hour and a half from the ocean, but that is the ocean pushing this tide up the Delaware and then up the Schuylkill. Only the fishermen know, and occasional kayakers. Tidefield gives you a way to look out on the river and to know, are we at high tide, are we at half tide, or are we at low tide? So if you can only see the top three red buoys, that's high tide. And then as the tide drops to half tide, the buoy strands will start to arc in a kind of caterpillar-like arch. And then when the tide is low, they lay out like sleepy caterpillars on the water. So you get a full three colors at low tide and less and less as the tide rises. I like putting my art in places where people will unexpectedly come across it. And particularly if they have a repeat visit, they'll start to see slight changes happening in the piece. The surface of the water is very animated, but we kind of lose track of that. But if you put something out there that captures that animation and amplifies it, you really see how variable the water surface is. There are micro patterns of wind blowing through, and these things are responding in a big way. I hope that people come down to the river and spend more time with nature and start to see the tide and get that feeling that I get like, wow, nature's happening here. It's happening in my backyard. And getting the sense that I'm at home in the world. <laughs>